Once upon a time, there lived a very hungry caterpillar named Chompy. Chompy wasn't just any caterpillar, though. He was a very special kind, one who would soon become a beautiful butterfly. But before that amazing transformation could happen, Chompy had a very important job to do, find the perfect place to build his cocoon. Chompy munched on juicy leaves all morning, his little body growing bigger and stronger with every bite. Tummy full, he declared, wiping his fuzzy mouth with a happy sigh. Now, it was time for his big adventure. He set off on his journey, inching across a bright green meadow. The warm sunshine tickled his back as he surveyed the world around him. Hmm, Chompy pondered. Where shall I build my cozy cocoon? Suddenly, a friendly ladybug named Lucy landed right next to him. Hello there, little one, she said with a cheerful chirp. Where are you off to in such a hurry? Chompy explained his quest, his voice filled with excitement. I'm looking for the perfect spot to build my cocoon so I can become a butterfly. Lucy's wings fluttered excitedly. Oh, that's such a wonderful adventure. Maybe I can help you find it. Together, Chompy and Lucy explored the meadow. They climbed tall blades of grass, peering over the top like tiny explorers. They peeked under colorful pebbles, imagining a cozy nook underneath. But nothing seemed quite right. Just then, a wise old grasshopper named Mr. Hopper hopped by. Greetings, young friends, he boomed with a raspy voice. What brings you to my part of the meadow? Chompy explained his search for the perfect cocoon building spot. Mr. Hopper stroked his long green legs thoughtfully. Hmm, he said, a good cocoon needs to be safe and hidden. Predators like hungry birds wouldn't dare to find it there. Following Mr. Hopper's advice, Chompy continued his search. He crawled under a wide flat leaf, imagining the rain gently pattering on its surface. He peeked inside a hole in a sturdy log, picturing himself safe and sound inside. Yet, something didn't feel perfect. As the sun began to set, painting the sky with streaks of pink and orange, Chompy felt a bit discouraged. Maybe there isn't a perfect place. He sighed, his little green head drooping. Lucy, noticing Chompy's frown, landed on his back with a comforting pat. Don't worry, Chompy, she said with a reassuring hum. The perfect place will find you. Just wait and see. Suddenly, a gentle breeze swept through the meadow, carrying the sweet scent of flowers. Chompy followed the smell to a beautiful rose bush. Its plump, velvety petals were the color of sunshine. As he climbed the thorny stem, a bright idea popped into his head. He spun his silky cocoon right there, nestled amongst the fragrant roses. The thorns would protect him from harm, and the soft petals would cradle him like a cozy bed. Exhausted from his long day, Chompy drifted off to sleep, feeling safe and happy in his perfect little spot. Days turned into weeks, and Chompy's cocoon grew bigger and stronger. Inside, a magical transformation was taking place. His tiny legs and fuzzy body were changing into something incredible. One beautiful morning, the cocoon began to tremble. A tiny crack appeared, then another, until with a final push, a magnificent butterfly emerged. Chompy's wings were a dazzling blue, shimmering with tiny golden spots. He flapped them tentatively at first, then with growing confidence, soared high above the meadow. From above, he saw his friends waving at him, Lucy, the kind ladybug, and Mr. Hopper, the wise grasshopper. Chompy chirped a happy greeting, his heart bursting with joy. His journey to find the perfect cocoon had led him to an amazing transformation, and now he was ready to explore the world as a beautiful butterfly.